lives. Um, he's a fence, so he's probably... Was he an Argonian or a Khajiit? Oh, fun. wow, lucky me. Are you looking for a fence? Alright, let's do this. This is a Show lot of stuff, stuff, so hopefully I can, uh... Hopefully this will cover the next, like, three, uh, special thieves guild jobs. A fine... Deal. Okay. Some of this stuff I'd actually like to keep, but then again, if I get, uh... If I get sent to jail, then I lose Deal. it all anyway. Deal. I can steal. Alright. Divining the Elder Scrolls. I don't know what that is. But if I can sell it, then it's not important. Let's see if he has any lockpicks I could buy. Oh yeah, a hundred. So that's a hundred. That's six gold for each. How about... Um, Twenty would be nice. How much is that? 120 and I am... Oh yeah, I, I can easily afford that. Just walk away like you don't know me. Hey everybody, Shadow this guy's a thief. He fences for the Thieves Guild. 300, and how much did I fence? Are you looking I assume for it goes up by 100 increments, so... Show me your stuff. Oh yeah, I got the next two covered. Alright, now I'm just gonna wait till... I'm gonna wait until the morning, and then I'm gonna buy some new armor and stuff. So it's 1029, about 12 hours. One of the problems, though, with recording is my throat gets dry really quickly, as well as with my lips. But when I drink water, my throat also gets dry. It sounds funny, but I guess it's just poor quality water or something. Not to mention I also have a cold. I would take a throat lozenge, but I don't know how that's going to show up on the recording. Let me let me find out. Hopefully I won't sound like an idiot. Alright, so it is now daytime. Only I would have a throat lozenge <laughs> while recording. Kind of unprofessional, but as long as I don't start biting down on it. The dividing line between Jesus, that guy looks creepy. Look at him. He's got like a. Is a sharp sword. <laughs> That's terrifying. Get the best you can afford from Tunzius. Because you don't want to be on the dead guy's side of the line, do you? Definitely not. Okay, um. I'm gonna repair what I have the now. Price, I can wow, six any. gold. In real life, if you want to get stuff repaired, you'd be paying like six hundred. Have a look at my way. Hopefully, he's got actually some sure useful stuff. All the people have. Oh my god, he's got no apparel. Okay, what do I have now? I have a steel short sword. All right. Um. Wow, he's got nothing. He's got arrows, though. I could buy arrows. Fifty steel. Um, I don't even think, I don't even think my, um, uh, one of my major skills is, uh, archery. Oh, no, this is not what I'm looking for. Major, okay. It is not, so I would be wasting my time. Oh, wow, I need to get some armor. Um, I don't know, I can't remember if armor or weapon shops are separate. I think they are. In Skyrim... What's Skyrim like? No, Skyrim, they're combined. I'm pretty sure I can ask guards, but... Oh, uh, no, I'm thinking of something else. I'm thinking of a different game. This game, you can't... You can't ask for specific places. I mean, I guess I could find out. But, um... Nonetheless, I don't really need to worry about it right now. I am going to head back to Scriva, and we are going to get the next Thieves Guild job. I'm actually probably going to have to spit this lozenge out because if I have it um, have it on the side of my mouth, then it my teeth keep colliding with it, and then you'll hear it on the recording, and it'll sound stupid. Not really, but it's... I like to have roughly flawless recordings. Uh, I know with shitty mic quality like mine, I'm not really going to get that. Um, and it kinda, it's kind of sad that I don't have a professional mic yet. Well met. 
I've upgraded to HD for a while now, like coming close to a year, but my mic quality is still not HD yet. And I'm pretty sure it looks like Screeve is in her home, right? Wrong. She's at the, um, what is that, a lodge or something? It's kind of annoying how in May I got a, I got a cold. But then again, here in Canada, it's only now warming up. Last year, it got warm in March. We got, uh, plus 20 weather in March, but, uh, we actually just got snow. We actually just I'm got snow last week. And it's all gone now, but it's still only like uh, plus 13 outside. 13 degrees Celsius. And for uh, Americans and I guess other places, that's that's close to what? Like, uh, I actually have no clue. I don't, I'm not even going to try to guess. Ah, the prowler approaches. Probably like... Um, Something, something, Fahrenheit. She is really short. I've been better. I would not want to fight her. When you murder someone, Amuse sends his regards. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Uh, I have a small problem that you may be able to help with. The guild will even pay a reward. Well, I hope so. The buffoon Hieronymus Lex has invaded the Imperial City waterfront. Imperial watch guards from all over the city prowl the streets. Hieronymus Lex has vowed not to leave until the Grey Fox is in custody. The Fox is safe, but the Thieves' Guild cannot do business like this. The poor of the waterfront are kindred to the Grey Fox and will not betray him. However, cubs soon get hungry. Soon someone will break. Many Guild members could be jailed. Find Methrodil in the Imperial City. She is coordinating the Guild's response. All right. Uh, I guess Shadow we head off to Methrodil the then. Um. Okay, my nose is starting to get a little bit too plugged. Okay, Hieronymus Lex is there. I gotta go find Methrodil. Holy shit, she's it. Well, actually, pretty sure those are baggers. Let's go to the market district. Oh, come on. I gotta go outside first. Yeah, my my nose is actually getting super plugged right now. And I don't really want to sniff because it sounds dumb. Okay, but then I have to breathe through my mouth, and then it's going to show up on the recording again, and uh, life is not fair. Let's put it that way. I should probably put my lozenges aside. I still got to get my hands on an Oblivion... Actually, it's a Cyrodiil map. It comes with the Oblivion game. I still got to get my hands on that. And then I want to frame my uh, frame both of them. Maybe I should get a Moro in the map, map as well. Although I haven't really played that game much, um, because I didn't play it at first, so it's kind of hard to um, downgrade from like uh, games. Like I have no problem playing older games. I should probably actually talk better. Please be generous, kind sir. Okay, so she speaks English. Thank you, kind sir. And then she switches to eighteen hundred beggar uh, language. Anyways, Methrodil. She's hiding in Denari Amnesty's house over in the Dallas Plaza district. She's one of the few that escaped when Lex invaded the waterfront. Oh, wow. That is one hell of a talent. I can't, I personally, I can't talk without moving my lips, but she's pretty damn good at it. Lex Anyways, uh, like I was saying, I have no problem playing older games. Absolutely no problem. Uh, they're some of the better crafted ones. Uh, but playing games like Skyrim, like I played Oblivion first, or the Elder Scrolls, and then I played Skyrim, and when you have like, when you have knowledge of their existence, like when you know what the games are like, and the combat, and the graphics, and the uh, voice acting, stuff like that, it's really hard to go back, uh, especially in like RPGs. Uh, for example, I personally love Final Fantasy uh, 7 and 9, and if I had played newer ones, I would probably go back what the hell is that? Oh, I thought it was a dead body for a second. Uh, I'd probably go back and play the older ones, and I'd be like, wow, these are uh, pretty bad. But I played Final Fantasy VII first, and uh, it's critically acclaimed game. Everyone loves it. But, um, you know, um, I just got onto it, and I fell in love with it. But had I played a newer Final Fantasy first, and then gone back to it, I'd be like, oh, this is hard, this is stupid, I don't like it. So I guess that's lucky on my part. I would always recommend playing older games first and then playing the newer ones. 